What's up guys, I'm Andy from 1A Auto. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to remove this interior trim panel on this 2012 Ford Escape. If you need any parts for your vehicle, click the link in the description and head over to 1AAuto.com. Open up the lift gate. Come back here. We wanna take this panel off first. Just grab underneath. Like that, set it aside, and just pull back this carpet. Slide that aside. This panel needs to come off, so we need to move the seats. All right, I'm just gonna grab under the back of the seat here, pull up, just fold it forward like that. I'm gonna remove this panel. I just need a trim tool to gain access to this panel. Just get underneath here. It's just a clip holding this in and just pry up like that. Oh, the clip fell out. That's okay. All right, on the front side over here, there's a little push pin over here. Just get in behind the panel. Push this out. Here we go. All right, now I can pry underneath this push clip. There you go. That one's pretty long too. And then we can slide this forward a little bit. I'm gonna have to pull the seat down. Right here, keep the seat belt out of your way. Just get in behind the panel and push it. Might have to use the trim tool. It's just clips holding it in. Just grab it, give it a good tug. If that door comes off, it's no big deal. Slide this forward. Slide this out. Now we're all set on the inside here, so I'll put this interior body panel back on. Just slide this in. Once it's in position, you can start pushing it on. It just clips in place. The weather stripping right here has to go over the panel. So just grab it and fold it over. Just like that. Make sure that hole lines up right there. Push the seat back there. Now this little push clip is gonna go right in here, just like that. And I'm just gonna slide this push pin out. Get this in position. Push that down. And then push the other push clip over here. There we go. Close that door push this seat back underneath. Just take this trim piece, line this up. Just like that, push it on. And we can take the carpet. that back in position and take this door that fell off and slide that back on. Thanks for watching. If you want the parts to do it yourself, check out 1AAuto.com, the place for DIY auto repair.